Hey everybody, this is Fran from the 5 Minute Modeler. And today uh, we're going to talk a little bit about cleaning track. And I'm here to tell you that I haven't cleaned my track in over two years. And I want you to see how it runs. A few years ago, Model Railroad Hobbyist had an article identifying the causes of dirty rail. I'm going to put a link to that article in the comment section. But the bottom line was the true cause was oxidation on nickel silver, uh, especially the rails. So what happens is after you clean your track in a few months, the performance starts to fade because the oxidation builds up on the rails. In a previous video, I described several methods for cleaning track. My method of choice was mineral spirits, but that wasn't enough. I still had problems with the track oxidizing. My friend Tom and I, we were talking a little bit about this product called Noox that supposedly prevents oxidation. He had purchased some and graciously gave me a lifetime supply, about a thimbleful, quite frankly. After applying it and running a few engines around, I was amazed at the performance. Especially with sound locomotives, there was no sputtering or restarting or any of those stalling effects. Now, it's been over two years since I've cleaned my rail and I'm not seeing any performance issues at all. Uh, the only thing that I've seen were a couple of uh, spots where there's been a buildup of, of a dark matter. I don't know if it's oil or crud or oxidation, but uh, generally by the frogs and uh, rough rail joints. And there doesn't seem to be any impact on the trains either. Um, the, the engine wheels, they appear to be clean as well. And I, I'll show a picture here. Now, my layout is in an unfinished basement, so there's a lot of foot traffic above it, and I'm sure that's knocking dust and junk down from upstairs. My main line runs over 100 feet, and I have three hidden and hard to reach sections, including the helix. Once I applied the NOAX to these areas, it's been smooth running. Now I will say, I'm not being sponsored or making any money off of this. I just wanted to share my results. Will I clean my rail soon? I don't know. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. But if I do see performance issues start to fade, then I will uh, likely clean it. Uh, so at any rate, I wanted to share these videos with you so that you can see how well it performs on various spots of my layout uh, at slow speeds and switching and so forth. So thanks again for joining another episode of the 5-Minute Modeler. We'll have more coming up. And if you have any questions or experiences, post them in the comments section. Others would like to hear how well it's been for you. Now, I got to say, not cleaning my rail for two years has been a great thing because there's three things modelers really typically hate. Ballasting, wiring, and cleaning track. And I just knocked one of those out with this product. So take care and hope you all stay well. And we'll catch you on another 5-Minute Modeler.